What is going on guys? Unite the Clans here back in Yo Life. And today we are doing something a little different. If you can't tell, I'm not here. This is a Raptor and this is the Play as Dino mod. Now this mod has been out for a little while guys uh, and in it you can play as a Raptor. It is sort of a precursor to the primal survival total conversion that is coming and it's sort of a halfway point. As you can see I am not really this Raptor. I am an invisible unkillable guy that rides this Raptor and when it dies uh, my game ends and I need to spawn in a new dino. Uh, but before we get into it as much as I love the coloring of this Raptor we are going to hit escape. We're going to hit change dino lose our progress, and I'm going to show you all the options that are currently available. Uh, there are two things that have made me uh, consider trying this mod again, and the first is that they have added in new functionality for two of the dinosaurs. Now, when you click to spawn, you have your standard screen, but when you've got the mod enabled, you can click up here in the top right and click play as dino. Now, if you would like to create a nest, lay eggs, hatch babies, and raise a family in this mod, you're going to have to do it as a female, and there are only two dinos you can currently do it as. First is the Pteranodon, and that brings me to the other reason I decided to play. I saw Zul'jin from the Pooping Evolved server playing this mod, and it looked really fun. He was playing as a Terra. The other animal that you can now build nests and raise babies with is the raptor. So I think that's what we're going to do. I've selected a raptor, I've selected female, and I'm going to spawn somewhere I know to be fairly safe. So let's take a look at the west zone 2. That's my home on the iron mine server, the uh, Crags Island. So let's spawn there. Let's go ahead and name ourselves Raps. Pretty good. And let's create a new dino. All right, so here we go, right where we left off. I uh, admittedly don't like the coloring on this guy as much. But if watching Zul'jin play is any indication, we might die and have to start over a few times. So if you take a look, what I now have in my inventory is this blueprint nest, which requires 20 hide and 6 chitin or keratin. And if you look in the bottom left, it says find a male to mate. So our first task, I think, is to get some XP, kill some easy stuff, collect some hide, and hopefully some chitin or keratin along the way as my dog has a coughing fit in the background don't mind that guys um and we'll get our raptor leveled up now this for me is a cool mod i'm really excited for primal survival in it there are going to be i think seven playable species at launch and those will include mammals and birds all kinds of stuff and i'm really looking forward to it uh, i think a few of the crew on the server are going to start and join a server just for primal survival so while we wait for that i figured we would give this a go and i'm looking for easy pickings up here um, I did a practice run, and I picked fights with a bunch of Dillos, and it didn't go so smooth. You are really soft. Take a look at my stats. I think my worst Raptor on the Iron Mind server has 1,000 health. So we're really, really weak. So we got to pick our battles wisely. we got to secure our stamina and run if we get in trouble. A Parasaur is an easy kill for a Raptor. I got the speed on them, and if I can get him stuck, I'll just be able to finish him off. Shoot. Okay, well, where is he now? Okay, well, he's making it difficult, isn't he? All right, let's, let's get all over this freak. I think he's going down right now. And you can see my stamina is at least half gone at this point. So let's take a minute and let that recharge. Okay, everything's gathered. So I've got the uh, the rates set. The only things that are really different is I have, uh, I think, two times or so gathering. Because when I played with the vanilla settings, it was really hard to get the basics required for a nest. Um, and so you can see from there, uh, I guess we need... Th oh, there's a raptor. Guys, we may be able to mate if that's a male. Okay, he's busy attacking a parasaur of his own. And we got a corpse right here. Is that a... Shoot. Okay, the, we need keratin or chitin, so killing bugs would be a good idea, but I don't want to accidentally attack one of these raptors. Going into the same fight as them can be deadly, so let's see if we can taunt these Meganora to come get us. Oh shoot, there's a level 15. This could be bad. Okay, they are down. Let's get that chitin. Let's get it. Okay, and there's another, another Meganora all over me, and we can't lose those raptors. I gotta find him and see if one's a male. There you are. Hi, female. Get lost, girl. I'm looking for a boy. Boy raptor. I think that's a male raptor. Jeez. Okay, just stay within range and watch that mating bar go up. I just kind of need to keep him from getting too excited chasing down another parasaur. 
And wait, wait, wait. I think we're going to do it. I think we're going to get get some. Yes, okay. Mated. Added a fertilized raptor egg. This is not taking long at all. So let's go ahead and peek. We now have a fertilized raptor egg, and we've got a level to apply. So let's go ahead and throw it on stamina, because that is never enough. And what do I need to get to this blueprint? Okay, we need a lot more hide and a lot more keratin. So let's um, let's pick our, uh, our battles wisely. And I think what I'd like to do is head towards the redwoods. In the redwoods, that might be a cool place to make a nest. And it's one of the more uh, pretty parts of this map. To be honest, I really wanted to start. There's a dead parasaur. There's some free hide. I'll take it. Oh, don't get hurt. Okay. Oh, geez. I am so soft. Oh, there's a lot of dead stuff here. All right, there's more hide. We might already have the hide we need for this nest and a dead raptor. Okay. No, no apologies for taking that. Okay. So no, we've got the hide and we just need some keratin and it's time for a nest. Now, I don't know if I'm going to have to make it all the way to, uh, to the redwoods. I think Craig's Island might be a safe, secure place. Oh, look, we might get exactly what we need right here. Give me some keratin. Give it to me. Oh, shoot. Okay. What kind of a level trike are you? You don't have a spyglass, which makes this interesting. That's a level two. Jeez, guys, he's stuck. All right, let's see what we can do. Let's see if we can knock him free. Or not knock him free. Let's see if we can take him out while he's stuck. I think I can. I think we can take advantage of this stupid old trike, and maybe we'll get some keratin out of it. I see another raptor down there. Now there's a cooldown delay on mating. So my nest can hold up to three eggs. Come on, give me the good stuff. Give me something good. Okay, one keratin. I think we are one chitin or keratin away. I keep opening my inventory and I have to remember you gotta open the raptor's inventory. Okay, two chitin or keratin away. Now that's a fellow raptor attacking that stego. Stegos are not fun to mess with. Their tail swings do a lot of damage, and me being as low level as I am, I don't even want to catch that by accident. But I do want to be close in case this raptor wins this battle, which he won't. No, he's going down. At the very least, we might be able to pick off an already damaged Stego if we let something else go near him. Okay, he doesn't seem to be mad at me despite me being a raptor. And another raptor just killed him, so... Oh, 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 corpses everywhere, guys. Stego, beautiful. Give me the good stuff. No chitin or carrot. Dang it. Get lost, you little compies. Think I'm scared of you? Okay, so I think what we need to do, guys, is kill something to attract some bugs. That's the way I'd do it in survival if I needed chitin or carrot. Uh, and, oh, that is a titanosaur. Huh. Oh, and there's a spino. Spinos, I don't think, will play nice with the raptor. I think he would come and eat me if he had the opportunity. So let's let's play this safe. Let's look for a little more chitin or keratin. There's a turtle. Turtles, especially in the early game, whether you're an early level dino or an early level player, they are a mess to deal with. They got a lot of health, and uh, they will continually fight back. They will not run away from you, although you could outrun them for sure. Okay, there's a spitter chasing a monkey. None of those have chitin or keratin. All right, let's try. What level are you? Level three. Let's find a really low level animal. We'll kill it and we'll see if we can get some bugs to come out. Because if we can't, here, let's take this dodo down. Get wrecked, dodo. Get destroyed by a giant raptor. There you go. Okay, now let's leave this be. Because dead bodies tend to attract bugs. So we'll see if we can get some to come out this way. I don't need the hide right now. What I need is chitin or keratin, and you can get those from scorpions, a little bit from stegos and from trikes, a little bit from carnos. You can get them from bugs. Um, I really, I could get them from the trilobites that are on the beach here, but being as weak as I am, I don't feel confident about that. Now, I don't know if you guys saw in the intro when I was picking this dino, just how many of their options there are but after we've played once made a nest once and if this series is doing well you guys are leaving likes and i'm enjoying myself we'll go back and try some of the other dinos it's got a lot of what's available in the game i think over 40 options right now for what you can play with um, now a lot of those will be like just like riding and leveling up a dino they won't involve the the there there's a meganura come on come on meganura come get me why? He's just hovering directly above my head. I think I got him. Okay, come back for more, you doofus. 
Oh, I'm out of stamina? Okay. I'm out of stamina. And there's a lot of them. Oh, guys. This is not gonna go well. I gotta fight. I gotta fight. I gotta fight and survive. I gotta run. I gotta run for my life. Oh, shoot. Oh, my gosh. I am in trouble. Are they on me? They are so on me. I don't have time to stop and pump food. My health is so low. Okay, I gotta get these things to leave me alone. I don't know how. Lure them into something else? I am beat up and injured and my stamina is down and if I keep running, I'm just gonna collapse from uh, the torpor. Let's get underwater maybe? Maybe they can't get us underwater. It's the only thing I can think of right now. Okay, we're underwater. I think they've left us alone. Oh my gosh. All right, let's get on the beach before I pass out. My torpor is at the maximum. All right, I'm going to pump some food, guys. In fact, I think I'm going to take a break in the middle of this episode. In a second, hopefully we will get what we need to build a nest and lay our egg. I got to run. I'll be right back. Um, we survived it. Kind of. Uh, I got swarmed by those Meganeuras shortly after I left you guys and it dropped this raptor. I killed a bunch, but their corpses have already despawned. They were all along this beach. Uh, and the last one, the one that take, took this raptor down and put it to sleep, well, they're, um, it's wandered off. And because of the nature of this mod, when this raptor goes unconscious, I just land on my feet. And I'm not going to break any rules. I'm not going to pick anything up. I'm not going to feed force feed the raptor i'm just gonna wait for him to get up and if something happens to kill him bef her before she does then uh we will start over but uh i'm just gonna sit here and wait and when i'm back up and able to mount this raptor again we will continue our quest for chitin and to build this nest come on come on you're almost there okay all right guys she is back up and these raptors don't feed themselves. You can see food is only going down. We're going to need it to get the health back up anyway. So I'm going to remote use uh, half a stack or something like that. And that should get us pretty close to full health here. Let's finish this stack off if we're not back up there yet. Perfect. So we are still in need of chitin and keratin. I'm going to look for some easy targets. A level 1 carbo. No other turtles around. I don't know if that's worth the, the risk. We can always outrun them. Uh, let's go ahead and give it a try. But they're tanks. Uh, so keep an eye on the health. Stamina is going to be a bigger issue than anything. He's getting beat up already. Okay, he's got better range than me. So I need to get in and attack. Okay, let's get ourselves some distance. And we'll let the stamina recharge. How about this distance? All right, and night is upon us. I'll, I'll adjust the gamma as soon as I get the chance, guys. All right, I'm going to run away as quick as I can until that stamina gives up. All right, and we are going to try and force feed ourselves back to health. And we got to level it to apply, so I'm going to go ahead and do that on stamina again. And uh, let's adjust the gamma. All right, that turtle is still after us. I'm not sure how beat up he is versus us. I think he's too big a target for us to take down. I'm going to stick in as long as my stamina holds up this time around. He's pretty beat up. I think we can do this, guys. I think we can do it. But he hits hard. Okay, let's pull away, and we are almost out of meat to force feed. All right. This, this will be the source of the chitin and keratin we need. But let's let him come to us. Hopefully he's not regaining too much health. But we're going to have the stamina to go in and hopefully finish this turtle off. Let's adjust the gamma one more time. We'll make it a touch brighter. Hopefully that helps for you guys. And we're going to get to build a nest. If, yes, we did it. All right. Okay, let's get in here and try and get the most out of this thing. Gimme. Yes. One one chitin one keratin and we are still short all right guys i'm gonna hunt for my next target i'm gonna try and ride out the night and i will come back to you in the morning Ooh, i think i have found the method guys if you're playing as a raptor trilobites i got three chitin out of the deal and it didn't 
kill me like a turtle almost did and like the Meganura almost did. Uh, so now is the time to find a spot for a nest. I know where it is, but it is dark and rainy. So I'll do what I said I was going to do before and I will wait out the night and come back with you in the morning from the perfect spot to build this nest. All right. I believe it is morning, the sun is rising, and I want to build my nest on the highest point on Crags Island. Like I said, this is a fairly safe place to be. We're going to be ready to mate and lay another egg soon, and every nest can hold up to three eggs. So I'm going to head up here to uh, one of the prettier spots on this whole island where we have ruins, glowing little specks of who knows what fireflies and oh i didn't mean to hop off uh so let's have a look in our raptor and take a look at this blueprint uh, so we can craft the item and it should pop up as a nest in our inventory and if i do this right we're going to remote use it and it's going to pop out underneath us which it has now the texture on the nest is nothing too fancy but while i'm in here i am going to drop the egg as well so Let's open up the raptor inventory, and we will drop this fertilized egg. Don't remote use it. Drop it. Okay. So uh, to actually get a good look at this is hard in the raptor, uh, in the first person of the raptor, but we can check on it. Let's make sure it's incubating and that the egg health is decent. Oh, it's so hard to see here. Let's hop off the raptor. We'll go into this first person mode, and we'll have a look. All right, incubating, perfect. So guys, I think that does it for episode one. Uh, we have built a nest in the ruins atop Crags Island, my traditional home in Ark. And uh, in the next episode, we are ready to mate. So we're gonna go try and find another male raptor, assuming that you guys like this enough for me to uh, produce an episode two. We'll find another male to mate with. We'll get another egg, we'll put it in the nest, and hopefully by next episode, we'll be hatching babies. Little adorable raptor babies. But uh, for this one, guys, let's get into the sunlight. There you go. That is going to do it. My name is Unite the Clans, playing for the first time as a raptor, using the play as dino mod. If you want to see more, make sure to drop a like. And uh, if you're brand new to this channel, subscribe. I don't play this very often. In fact, this is episode one, but I play a lot of Ark Survival Evolved. So you might like what you see. Check the cards in the top right corner. I will put some of my favorite videos up there just for you new people. Thank you for watching, and I will see you all in the next episode.